Well, much closer to home, using bulldozers and rakes, crews are working feverishly to get the North Wildwood beaches ready for visitors for this upcoming holiday weekend. Yeah, in March, the mayor said that the beaches may not be ready after storms battered them, causing much of the built up sand to be washed away. So, what's the verdict? Ryan Hughes hit the beaches. He's live in North Wildwood with the answer for us. Ryan. Natasha and Siafa, good afternoon. Well, the good news, the city says the beaches will be open. Behind me, it's hard to see, but we already have some people with the beach chairs and the beaches, beach towels out already. We're standing at 13th Avenue. If you walk with me here, we're told the erosion in this area was eight feet high at one point. Take a look at it now. It's been almost completely leveled off after those emergency repairs. This work happening right before the unofficial start of summer. It's a race against the clock in North Wildwood as bulldozers move sand on a stretch of the rapidly shrinking shoreline. Chopper 3 over the emergency repairs as the city prepares for large crowds during the busy Memorial Day weekend. I was glad to see him because all winter we were told that there wasn't going to be a replenishment program. North Wildwood is repairing dunes and beach access points between 12th and 16th Avenues, some of the most heavily eroded areas. New Jersey's Department of Environmental Protection granted permission for the repairs last week, citing safety reasons. And the work began Monday morning. Right now we're working on getting rid of the dangerous cliffs. Some pieces might have been as tall as 15 feet. North Wildwood City Administrator says the city declared an emergency in October after Hurricane Ian battered the beach. But the city and state have been fighting for years on how to protect the shoreline from erosion, a battle that's led to $33 million in litigation with the replenishment project still years away. Since we lost mostly all of our protection and the level of the beach berm, that every high tide cycle and, and just minor storm has been eating away at our, at our protective dune system. Now, as some get an early jump on the weekend, many are thankful to get their beach back. It's going to open up so much more space for everybody, uh, especially with all the people coming in, so very exciting. And the city says that beach battle is still working its way through the court systems. In the meantime, the city also saying that these emergency repairs should be completed sometime tomorrow afternoon. We are live in North Wildwood. Ryan Hughes, Siaf and Natasha, back to you. All right, Ryan, thank you so much.